and welcome to Chart of the Day Cafe for Thursday, July 28th, 2016. Just going to read our disclaimer quickly. Trading stocks has a high level of risk and viewers should complete their own due diligence on any stock or underlying that they intend to own. 100% of the content of this video and communique is intended for journalistic and educational purposes only. This video and all indicators, strategies, and articles herein should not be construed as investment advice. Thank you for your patience with that. And I'm going to keep today's video really short just because it's the last one before I go away on holidays. Really just recapping the things we've been looking at so far. Um, as always, we start our videos off with a look at the Russell Index. And for that, we use the IWM, looking at it on a five-year monthly time frame. And we've been paying particular attention to the blue channel that the Russell traded within through all of 2014. Had this lift up and out in early 15, the subsequent sell-off. And here's where we are right here, right now. Candle for the month of July, bullish for sure. We still have a couple of, uh, you know, today and tomorrow left, but um, a very bullish looking candle followed by this doji. That was a little bit concerning, but um, so far for the month of July, we are up and over that blue channel line. Just as a reminder, we've been talking about where the Russell is overall. I'm going to pull it into the yearly and go to the index itself as opposed to the ETF. So you can see... We've got that little orange line drawn in here because we're at this the top of the range that was important here at 15 and 15 and, and 14. So we're keeping an eye on things here. Um, going back to our, I'm going to actually show you very quickly the 10-year monthly just to get that better perspective. I like to uh, step back and really look at things from uh, a broader perspective. So there's where we are right here right now. Uh, again, we are looking at the index. This is the ETF. There we go. Um, the two sectors that we've been kind of talking a little bit about lately and keeping an eye on are the transports. Uh, this would be, again, we're looking at the index for the transports. and We have this orange line of support drawn in here. Just my rough line, just a rough area. Um, and here's the candle so far for the month. So that's a pretty good looking candle so far. So the transports seem to be holding up well. And the other sector that we've been talking about and, and focusing on, especially in last Tuesday's video, is the uh, banking sector trading in this larger wedge pattern. We're looking at it. This is the index itself, the BKX. Looking at it on a 10-year monthly time frame, trading in this wedge and kind of dancing around this apex area. So keeping an eye on this sector, but so far for the month, looking good. Um, but I would be paying particular attention to those, I think, in the uh, weeks and months ahead. Um, so with that, I am going to keep today's video short and uh, hope you have a ne uh, good next couple of weeks. And we will lob up another video towards the uh, middle to end of August. Thanks. Take care.